Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll show you guys how to stream your Windows 7, 8 or 10 PC screen to your Nintendo Wii. So this thing is insane. I can't believe this thing still works, but it does. So all of the links are in the description to this video. The first link you will need to download is called Ultra VNC. This is the software that lets you stream your PC screen. So what you want to do, you just want to go down here. As you can see, you can download the latest version. This is actually updated and Sunday the 21st of January um, 2018. So you know this has been updated not too long ago. Um, surprisingly this still works so just go ahead and click on that. Now, so once you've clicked on that you can just scroll down a bit more. As you can see you want to get this one, the 64 bit for all operating systems. So you know if whatever you're on this should work so just go ahead and download that. Then you just need to scroll down again and just click the download button right here. You have to accept the agreement and then just click download. Right, so once you've downloaded that software, you want to head over to this link. This is a link to a Wii Brew page. As you can see, this is actually the Wii VNC software. So what you want to do, you just want to hit the download link right here. So that is all of the programs you'll need. So once you've got those two, you can just head over to your downloads folder. So the first thing you want to do is just copy the Wii VNC files into your Nintendo Wii's SD card. So I'm just going to right click um, extract here. Then you just want to copy this folder to your apps folder on your Wii's SD card. So mine's plugged in here. I'm just going to put this in the apps folder. Just copy it across. It'll only take a few seconds. So you should be able to find it. Yeah, it's right here. So once that's copied across, you're pretty much done with the Wii's SD card. Now you can just delete these files and what you need to do is just install the Ultra VNC setup. So just double click it. Then you just want to click run. Uh, click yes to agree to this agreement. Then you choose your language. I'm going to choose English. Press OK. You want to accept this one. Click next, next. You want to install everything that's um, on default, so the full installation. Click next. Click next again. And then you can just click, you don't have to tick any of these. Then you can just click install. So it's going to install fairly fast. Then you can just click next again. And you can untick this one right here and then just do finish. So that is um, Ultra VNC now installed. If you just back out to your desktop, um, what you can do is just search it. As you can see, these are all the apps. So these are the two we need. We need the viewer and the server. So the first thing you want to do is just open the server version. So as you can see, the um, Ultra VNC server is now running down here. So what you want to do is just right click and go to admin properties. So this is where you need to set everything up so it can connect to your Wii. So the first thing you want to do here is set a password. So I just like to uh, don't have these. You guys can literally put anything you want. I'm just going to type in password because that's easy. So just type that in twice. Now you can also change the ports here. I'm going to leave it on 599900. So make sure your Wii is on that port as well. So that is pretty much everything. You can just leave it like this. Then you can just do apply. So it's going to come up with a message, click OK. Now it's also going to come up with this sort of admin message, so just press yes on that as well. And then you can just press OK. So that's it, everything is saved. You might have to agree again. But basically, if you look in this small um, hidden icons area and hover over the VNC, it will show you the IP address which you need to enter into your Wii. So VNC is now um, running, so your laptop's now looking for something to connect to. So what you want to do is head over to your Wii and I'll show you guys what to do next. Hi guys, so here I am on my Wii. What you want to do first is just load up the homebrew channel. So you just want to scroll along until you get to the Wii VNC bit. So here's mine. What I'm going to do is just press A on it and then just load it. 
So once you're on this bit, this is where you want to enter the IP address that you have on your computer. So this is where you want to enter it. So I'm just going to see what mine is quickly. So if this isn't correct, you can literally just backspace and then enter in the correct one. Okay, so make sure the port number and IP are uh, correct, then just do connect. So it's going to try and connect. Now it's going to ask you to enter in your password. So for me, it was just password. Then click enter. Now it's going to try and connect. And here you go, guys. It is now connected to my PC. So as you can see, um, this is sort of the mouse. I can actually click on stuff. Um, so like the start menu, you can just press A to click. It's kind of laggy, but it does, you know, sort of work. Um, you can use plus and minus to zoom in as well. So as you can see, plus zoom in. Um, I can, you know, you can zoom in wherever the mouse is pretty much. You can literally move around your whole screen. Just press minus if you completely want to back out. So you can do other stuff as well, like um, let's say open Google Chrome. Um, it's Google Chrome there. And then that will open up. So yeah, guys, this it does have a few glitches, like this text glitch right here. But I mean, what do you expect? Like, I'm surprised this thing even worked in the first place. So we could just cross that off. But yeah, guys, um, this thing is pretty insane. Um, you can probably like run games through this as well. You know, you can drag and all that kind of stuff. Um, there's a few other options that will show you on the um, when you go to load it up on the Homebrew channel. It will show you all the instructions there. You can also find more instructions on the Weebrew page itself. So I guess this is more like a kind of gimmick than anything extremely useful. But it is pretty cool that you can stream your um, Windows 10 computer to your Nintendo Wii. So if you guys want to cut the connection, all you have to do is on your laptop, just go to the little drop down menu right here. Um, where it says the um, win VNC, all you do is right click, close VNC connection, and as you can see, the connection will back out, and you will probably back to the home brew menu on your Nintendo Wii. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.